A basketball coach at Riker High School in Waco is looking for answers tonight after he was fired earlier this week. He says he believes he was fired for reporting what he considered inappropriate text messages he received from the school's athletic director to the principal. Channel 6 News reporter Curtis Quillen is here with more. Curtis? Doug and Leslie, Derek Harris just led the boys basketball team at Riker to their best season in more than a decade. Tonight he's without a job and he says he doesn't know why. Like you said, he believes it's because he reported inappropriate text messages that he received from Riker's athletic director Mark Sloak. Harris was suspended two games for filming another private school opponent without consent at a holiday tournament. Harris attended one of those games from which he was suspended. And after they lost, he texted the result of the game to the AD. The AD replied, why are you letting black people shoot LOL? How are you holding up? And only the white kids don't you know. It's also worth noting Harris was suspended an additional three games because he was yelling from the stands from one of the, those first two games of his suspension. But tonight, Harris is out of a job and without answers from school administration. I reported these comments to our, our, our principal, which is our superior of the AD and myself, because I didn't think I can talk to him about it because he was actually the one that made the comment. So, and he, him being my boss, I figured I'd bring it to them and we can see um, what the situation was with that. Just after 4.50 this afternoon, we received this statement from the Riker principal, Mindy Taylor. It reads, the information you have is not accurate nor complete. These types of matters are not appropriate for public discussion. I asked what was not accurate, but have not yet received a reply. An attorney for the athletic director also called me about 3.45 this afternoon, saying they he didn't feel like he had enough time to respond. This is after I originally emailed the AD and principal just after 1 this afternoon, and the school had already replied, declining comment. I spoke with another former coach at Riker, and tonight at 10, I'll tell you what he had to say about his time working under this athletic director at Riker. Doug and Leslie.